My name is Matt Watson and I am the club photographer here at Southampton Football Club. When I first arrived here at Southampton Football Club there wasn't there wasn't a solution in place so we quickly realised we needed to have some form of searchable archive and that's when I just typed in those words on Google and that's one of the one of the first results I saw with Third Light and that's how it came about and it was just a case of having a look. It's not just for photographers, it's not just for digital media specialists, it's you know we, we use it across our club, not just in the media world and the whole commercial department. We use our, our sports scientists use it, our medical team use it. Um, so it's a tool that anyone anyone can use. So the digital media library that we have through Third Light is a really massive part of our content strategy. Imagery is really important to us and how we use it. Uh, we use it extensively on our website, on Twitter, on Facebook, on Instagram as well. So every single platform pretty much that we're publishing on, Third Light plays a role for us. Without Third Light, we would um, I think find ourselves in, in real difficulty compared to where we are now. Um, it's such a it's a system that allows us to be very, very nimble, particularly in live situations, so match days. We can get images from our photographer Matt's camera onto our website or out onto social media within maybe 30 seconds a minute of, of those images being taken and it, it's hard to imagine another resource whereby we would be able to do that and that speed for us in a live setting is just so crucial. Third Light now is a really innovative system which allows each player to have their own login and their own smart folder. So anytime I upload an image with uh, the, the player's name and a caption, it will go to that specific folder. They can log in, have a scroll through their own personal page and see all of their own images and save them directly. So it saved me a lot of time. I think it's extremely important for sports organisations to, to have a system that centralises all of their their imagery and, and media files because a, so much happens so quickly and often you're in a live situation and you need to be able to access those things swiftly and they need to be in a good order but also you're forever going back to you know mark moments in time and moments in history and, and you need to have access to those and you need to have that proper archive to ensure that you know those those key moments that happen for any football club or sports team are there and, and they're there to be documented in the future. So it's, it's extremely important in that sense. To me, a digital media library um, is a house or a home for all of your digital assets, in my case, photographs, um, somewhere that you can archive and keep hold of things that are gonna be of value to your organization, something you can get hold of quickly and use whenever you need.